Hello and welcome to my channel Capricorns. I apologize for the delay in getting your video up. Um, we just had so many technical issues going on yesterday. So I am happy to be able to get to your reading now at this time. So the reading that I will be focusing on for you today will be Will Your Ex Return? And the deck that I will be using will be the Romance Angels Oracle Cards by Doreen Virtue. Okay, guys, and if I do need to pull any clarifiers, I will do so. All right, Capricorns. So let's figure out what's going on in regard to X relationships and that X energy that's trying to come back into your life. Angels, please bring forth any and all messages for my Capricorns in regard to X partnerships. Please offer them clarity in regards to these issues. All right, Capricorn, just a couple more shovels. And one more. Okay. Will your ex return, Capricorn? Forgiving and learning. Okay. X return, Capricorn. Worth waiting for. Okay, pull one more. Capricorns. Wow. Honeymoon. And this card seems to want to come out. Codependency. Okay. And bottom of the deck, guys. Release your ex. Okay. So let's see what's going on here, Capricorns. So what I'm seeing here, guys. And please forgive my voice. It's totally early over here. I'm so completely hoarse. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, all right, guys. So in the past, you were in a relationship where there were definitely issues. I'm feeling a lot of arguments had occurred, a lot of disagreements, a lot of heartache, not seeing eye to eye. And in order to move forward from that relationship, you had to learn to forgive and learn from that relationship. So for a lot of you Capricorns, I'm feeling like you've moved on, you've released and healed from the past and you've learned from it and you've moved on beyond your ex because this card, release your ex, is definitely very prominent in this reading. Okay, so for those of you who've moved forward from the relationship where you needed to forgive and learn I feel that you've either evolved onto another relationship with more of a soulmate connection than the relationship that you just came out of. Because the relationship that you're currently in or will be in shortly will be worth waiting for. You will definitely have a better connection with this person than the one you were with, your ex. It's time to clear that energy the time has come for you to remove that element, that way of thinking from the past. It's time to release your ex, no question about it. Because moving forward, guys, this person who's worth waiting for, I see you guys getting married. And some of you will be enjoying a honeymoon with this person who's worth waiting for. Definitely more in tune with the type of romance and love that you're looking for. And for some of you Capricorns, I feel like you're either in this relationship now or you shortly will be. However, for some of you, even though you have released your ex, you're still demonstrating a bit of codependency in regard to that relationship. There were definitely addictive behaviors in your past relationships and some of you guys are bringing that forward into this new relationship. It's almost like 
I'm feeling there was a trust issue in this past relationship to where there may have possibly been a third party. And so even though you're enjoying this great relationship with this new soulmate type energy, there are still a little bit of trust issues with you guys to where can I fully give my heart to this person? Can I fully trust them? And so when I say addictive behavior in this instance, it's more like you're addicted to the person that you're currently with so much so that all your energy every minute every second of the day is going to this new relationship because you want it to work out so much better than what you had with your ex so i'm kind of feeling like you need to give this person a little bit of room a little bit of wiggle room to move about the relationship and not be so constricting to where they can't make a move without you knowing where they are or who they're with um to kind of remove yourself from that suspicious way of thinking that codependent way of thinking so i'm not feeling addictions by way of alcohol or drugs it's more behavioral moving forward because it is in the future position so no doubt capricorns you do need to release your ex if you haven't already okay for those of you who took the time to actually forgive and learn the situation, you have moved forward and you're now in this happy, more soulmate type relationship moving forward and you will be marrying this person. And the card after release your ex guys is soulmate. So there's definitely that soulmate energy wanting to come through and you're either again with this person already or you will be in the near future. All right, Capricorn, so that is what I'm getting for you at this time in regard to the issue of whether or not your ex will return. I'm feeling that you've moved on from that chapter of your life. And for those of you who are still contemplating whether to release them in your heart of hearts, this is urging you to do so because there is something so much better for you in the future by way of the soulmate connection. So you're either with your soulmate now or you will be soon. Okay, Capricorns, I hope that this helped some of you to figure out the issue in regard to your ex and that it resonated with some of you to where it offered you peace and you're able to move on beyond this issue. All right, Capricorns, if this was a reading that you resonated with, I would appreciate your like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Have a great day.